Yo, what is up, guys? It's me here, Cameron I'm Roberts Outdoors, back with another video. Um, it's Warfare Wednesday. Um, but you're probably wondering what I'm doing. Sitting down and, uh, sitting here really, uh, doing nothing. It's really cold out. Um, but, yeah, I did something, uh, I don't know if you guys know yet. Probably not, but I'm gonna flip the camera around here and show you. What is on my foot, huh? What is on my leg? I broke my leg. Yes, I broke my leg. Um, so, two Fridays ago, from now, I think it was two Fridays ago. Friday night, it was a Friday night, night like this. My cousin came over. We're going to do some play, play games on our phone and go over at the pond and play around. She came back, played on our phone. My sister went out and let out her, um, she walk, has to walk her dog because he's not trained to go out by himself yet. So we went out to try to scare her. We're walking up this hill. And um, we're hiding behind this bush. So we ran down the hill because she was coming around the corner. So we went down this hill and by our pool, it, it was wet on the grass too. We're, uh, we're by our whole pool. We we're going to hide behind the pool. So I was going to go down and hide behind the pool. So I was looking back and my sister, I thought she would be coming just to see if she was coming. So I kept on looking, wasn't paying attention to where I was going <coughs> and I uh, slipped. So, and then, it's called a spiral fracture. Um, so I kind of look in this way, and I slipped, and my leg kind of bent in, like, this. While I was looking this way, so you're like, and it snaps or something. I think that's how it goes. It's like at an angle, the break. And it's almost all the way through. I don't need surgery, which is really good. <coughs> um, two months, and I'll be up on my feet. Six weeks, and I might have a walking boot, but I really can't go out on the grass. Um, so I hope I can make some more videos. I know I'm not doing anything waterfowl related today, but today is waterfowl Wednesday, so I gotta start the intro. Intro starts now. intro but um you know it's kind of a weird intro so i had to go to the doctors that night it was night uh not this time it was pitch dark almost so i had to go to the doctors i mean the vet did i <laughs> i just said the vet <laughs> um uh that's for uh animals if you guys didn't know that a uh, vet is for animals I had, we had to go to the hospital, <laughs> um, I said vet, but I had to go to the hospital, um, went to the hospital, got, waited for a long time, got home at like 11, and I broke it at like 7, 30-ish, my dad got home for hunting, and we went to the, um, not the vet, the hospital, and yeah, waited, waited, didn't hurt too bad, just resting on laying down and stuff, they put this little homemade little wrap thing on it, which is not the green one here, not this one, not this one, so, we went, got it wrapped, came home, Then we, uh, I came home, laid down, went to bed. Next day, you know, on and on and on. It's been two weeks now, which is really good. Um, long ways to go, though, guys. I'll probably be better by Christmas, end of Christmas, a little bit past Christmas. So, yeah, that's how I broke it. Um, I wish you guys could be here signing, to sign it, but can't so but I got this one on 
two days later. It's all the way up here and bends down. And uh, I think four more weeks from now, which it would be six weeks and all. Um, they said six weeks, one, three days after I broke my leg. So six weeks, you go and get it down to here. Maybe down here, which is not very big. So it's been two weeks now, almost two weeks. I think one more day after this, and then they said you'd get one in six weeks from when that was. So right now it's two weeks, so that means four more weeks. I might get a shorter calf, and uh, or I don't know what it was, or a walking boot at like two or the week after that, which would be seven weeks. I might get a walking boot, which means I can walk. I'll show you a picture of the x-ray right now. Uh, actually, I was popping up on the screen. The x-ray, I think, if I can. If not, then I'll just put it on the end of the video. Um, so, yeah, this has just been a talking video. Uh, I'm sorry I didn't, you know, make any other videos. But, um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. i uh, so sorry if I don't make very many videos. Please don't unsubscribe. Please stay subscribed. Please stay a part of Karen Roberts Outdoor. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm getting really cold. Don't forget to leave a like. And please subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Wish, wish me luck. And I wish all you guys luck. Don't break your leg because it sucks. Um, on Saturday I will be posting. For sure. I believe. I'm going to be shooting clay pigeons. <clears throat> what I do is I just sit in a chair because I can make it over to where we shoot. We have a step, foot step clay pigeon launcher. And I am walking in crutches, by the way. I'm going to crutch it. So yeah, I'll be shooting clay pigeons Saturday. And I'll be showing you guys this. Um, I'll be showing you guys the video. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I'll put my Instagram right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like and please subscribe and like again. And go check out Black Boat Waterfowl and Outdoor Limits. They just posted. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.